Yellow Gamer Nom is back. And in this video, we're going to help this noob with the rework flame fruit, grind fast, and have our revenge on Akainu and also become pro. But before we start, you can show your support by using Starcode Gamer Nom when purchasing your Robux. 5% of the earnings will go to me, and this will really help us on making better videos. Where the actor slam on the dancing forward, there's your slam, there's the dump. So let me start with a question. Gamer Nom, is the flame fruit one of the best fruits for newbies? If you agree, comment it on the comment section. One of the reasons why this fruit is really good because of the mastery requirement. You only need 100 masteries to unlock all the skills. So now for our first skill, we have the Fire Bullets. A very good first skill, high damage, also multi-target. One more thing is that Flame Fruit is Elementar or Logia, which means if your enemy has no hockey and you reach the level requirement to get activated, the enemy cannot hit you. Okay, so for our go level, level 15 as usual, and we will be unlocking our F skill, the Fire Flight, for the stats, 43 blocks free. Okay, so we're gonna use our Fire Flight to go to the next island and if you guess the next island is the Fountain City and what we're gonna do here is what we usually do. We're gonna lure the Galley Pirates. Don't worry, this mob cannot damage you, check this out. So you're gonna use your Z skill and your left clicks to damage him. All you need to do is just repeat it and make sure to last hit him with your Flame Fruit, okay? Okay, so you will unlock your X skill, the Burning Blast, here it is which means one more additional skill to increase your damage. Also, you will unlock your C skill. Yes, your C skill, the fire column, and this grinding spot. So guys, you will be having three skills for damage and one F skill for transportation in just your second island, okay? So when you reach level 55, let's check our stats first. 15 melee defense, blocks for 135. Next island is the Pirate Village. Our target mob here is Bobby the Clown. Guys, can you confirm? According to some of the comments in my previous videos, Clown can be damaged by the sword now. If you know the answer, please comment it on the comment section. And for the technique here, just uh, use your skills. Make sure that after using your skills, you will dodge to the side. Because he will use his own skills. There you go. Also, try to create distance whenever your skills are on cooldown. Okay, so just keep on repeating that and most likely or eventually you will defeat him. Guys, keep in mind that we are just in the third island and we already unlock four of the five skills of this fruit. So guys, at level 60, we will go to the next island, the desert. So here our target is the desert bandits. Don't worry guys, Logia or Elemental is in effect. So no tips here, just keep on defeating these mobs until they reach level 75. Same strategy will work on the desert officers at level 75, check that out. Target level here, level 90. For the stats, melee defense 30, blast fruits 210. Next island is a frozen village. Don't forget that in the cave, you will find the ability teacher where you can buy the sky jump for 10,000, enhancement for 25,000, and flash step for 100,000. After that, go straight to snow bandits again. Logia or elementals in effect. So very easy to grind. Target level 105. After that, your next target is the Yeti, the mini boss in this island, over 106 here, but you can start defeating him at 105, okay? So technique here is the same, but not like Bobby the Clown, you don't need to dodge to the side, you just need to create distance. Again, I repeat, don't let this Yeti get near you because the damage of this boss is really high, and that is our technique for this boss, target level, level 130. For our next island, the Marine Fortress, your target is the Vice Admiral, the boss in this island. Don't forget to buy the Black Cape. There you go. For the technique, same strategy with Bobby the Clown, okay? There you go. He has long range slashes. That's very easy to dodge after your skills. Just dodge to the side. There you go. Use your skills. Dodge to the side. There you go. Use your skills, okay? One more thing, you will unlock your V skill, your final skill, the Flame Destroyer in this island. Here it is. We are going to leave this area at level 220. Next area is the prison and we have three bosses here. First is the Warden and the Technique Gamer Gnome, Wall Strat, okay? Let's do Wall Strat. 
he will be very easy to defeat. And after that, Chief Warden at level 230, same strategy guys. Again, another wall strat. And for the sword lovers out there, there's a chance that you can get the Warden's sword here on the Chief Warden. So let's remove this. This is not part of the grind. <laughs> And for today's episode of a new friend, I saw someone grinding here. Again, we're doing server hop who is using the death step. Very nice. And also using a sword. So guys, I don't know what sword he is using. So please help me comment it in the comment section. And aside from that, he has a fruit. A nice fruit. So guys, this player is a complete player. He's using O. But he started attacking us. Actually, we just get caught. There you go. He doesn't care if he will die. But we O. He died, guys. <laughs> I don't know if that's karma, but we will still defeat it and get more experience. Okay, so next boss, guys, is this one. And even if we are lagging, we can still defeat it. There you go, again. And if done properly, server hop, this area is the fastest area to grind. But take note, if you're in the public server, there are individuals just like this. But guys, if someone kills you, make sure to go fast and damage the boss because if you damage them enough you will still get experience okay okay so your goal level here is 350 and after that we are going to check our stats 100 melee and defense block fruits 850 after that next island is the magma village guys redemption time remember if you watch one piece it is ace versus akainu so now we are ace so we are going to beat this boss akainu there you go. So our technique, while damaging him, we are going to dash sideways after every time we attack because we want to dodge his attacks while waiting for our skills to cool down. So guys, there you go. Finally, Akainu. Redemption time. So guys, are you watching One Piece? If you are, what is the saddest moment for you so far in the series? Please comment it in the comment section. If you're gonna ask me, the saddest part is going merry, saying goodbye to the straw hats. Okay, so at level 425, yes, you're gonna head to the underwater city and defeat the fishman lord. Guys, this will be fast because again, we're just gonna do another wall strat here. Check that out. After luring him, just use your skills and that's it. Just avoid the flexors or the buoys and you will be fine. We are going to leave this area at level 500 for the stats. Meal defense 125, block fruits 1 to 50. Next up, the Skylands. So our target here is the Whisper. Guys, Stone Strat. Okay, the Stone Strat will work here. So lure him here. He cannot damage you with his bazooka. Another easy grind for us. You're gonna again do server up here until you reach level 637. Yes, you heard it correctly, 637. We're gonna skip the Shandas, the Royal Squads, the Royal Guards, and even Thunder God, okay? I hope that's clear. Also, again, if there is someone who's doing server hop and stronger than you, <laughs> there you go. Just don't mind him and focus on grinding. Again, if you damage the boss substantially, you will still get experience. Guys, the problem with other players is when they get attacked, they keep on talking, uh, complaining, you're a bully, etc. Guys, just don't mind them, okay? Okay, so we're gonna just continue grinding here again at 637. And after that, checking our stats, melee defense 150, block fruits 1611, fighting against the Fountain City. So for our final mob, the Galley Pirates, check this out guys, Logia, Elementals in effect. So no problem grinding, just keep on defeating them. The next mobs, the Galley Captains, they have hockey, and the boss Cyborg is not that easy to defeat. So we're gonna focus here, there you go, guys you can defeat them by just V and C skill, or if you want you can use 3 skills, okay? So there you go, you're gonna reach level 700 here, and that's it for this video guys, did you enjoy it? Again, comment it on the comment section if you have recommendations. Again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I really appreciate you all. This is GamerNom. GamerNom out.